Missouri, we're watching two homicide scenes. These calls came in just a minute apart. The slimmest of margins here. Detectives kind of split between these two scenes. Our Martin Augustine is live at the first scene near 83rd and Wayne. Martin. Well, we've learned in the last few minutes, Cody, that a teenage boy was shot and killed either in or nearby this home you see back here with the beige paint and the stone skirting. Of course, there's police tape up here in this neighborhood near 83rd and Wayne, and it'll remain up uh, for quite some time. Uh, that call came in of trouble here to police at 537. Police and, and EMS uh, arriving here. Uh, both the police officers and the medics uh, trying to give aid to that boy, but the medics determined that he was already dead. At that point, the task begins for detectives to try to figure out the sequence of events, what led to a, a confrontation uh, that led to gunfire and then to uh, the boy's death. So detectives now uh, doing what they do. They're fanning out across this neighborhood here around 83rd and Wayne. Uh, they'll be knocking on doors as many as they can, hoping to talk to people who heard something or perhaps saw something. They'll also be interested in taking a look at a security camera video or the that doorbell uh, a video that uh, some people have installed in their homes to see if that could shed any light uh, as to what happened here. At this point, they just have no idea uh, uh, what uh, what occurred that led to this boy's death. And also keeping in mind, too, we were reminded that police are not only trying to solve a crime, but they have to provide some very, very bad news to someone. This is tough. There's a family um, that's going to be notified about a victim, a loved one, um, and their world is going to be shattered. Now, one of the things that uh, Officer Drake points out is that uh, uh, that police and other people were involved in this sort of thing and trying to develop conflict re resolution uh, throughout the city to uh, get on top of this homicide issue is the fact that we're just not very good at that yet. And that's a step that has to be made uh, to make any improvement in the homicide numbers here in Kansas City. Reporting live, Martin Augustine, KBC 9 News.